everyone! Today we'll be reviewing the national flag of Japan. The review will be done using the five basic principles of flag design as outlined in the book Good Flag, Bad Flag, written by Ted Kay and published by the North American Vexillological Association. Here is a quick rundown of the five principles. We will review the flag under each principle and give a score out of 10 for each. At the end, we will calculate the average score of the five principles, which will give us the overall final score for the flag. Let's begin. The flag consists of a red circle centered on a white field. This is a very simple design and the flag is easy to draw from memory. For this principle, the flag scores 10 out of 10. The flag was first adopted in 1870, but the flag wasn't officially recognized as the national flag until 1999. It's believed the design was first used as early as the 12th century. The red disc represents the sun. The sun is a very important symbol in Japanese culture and history. The country is known as the land of the rising sun, and even the name of the country means the sun's origin. This is due to the geographical location of Japan. Its location east of mainland Asia means it is one of the first countries to usher in the new day. The sun also plays a huge role in Japanese mythology and religion. The emperor of Japan is said to be a direct descendant of the sun goddess Amaterasu, and she is a major deity of the Shinto religion. We don't know how the exact colors originated, but our theory is that it's a direct visual interpretation of a red sun rising over the horizon surrounded by a white-looking sky. When the flag was finally officially adopted in 1999, there was no specific symbolism applied to the colors, though a number of ideas exist. The white is said to symbolize honesty, integrity, and purity, while the red symbolizes sincerity, brightness, and warmth. While the flag loses marks due to the lack of official symbolism of the colors, the overall symbolism of the sun and its importance to Japan means it still gets a good score here. For this principle, the flag scores 9 out of 10. The flag has two colors. Those are red and white. Both colors are part of the standard set. There is good contrast between these two colors. For this principle, the flag scores 10 out of 10. The flag has no lettering, seals, or coat of arms. For this principle, the flag gets 10 out of 10. The flag is distinctive. Two other countries use a prominent disc on a plain field. The first of these is Bangladesh. They also use a red disc, though theirs is slightly off-center. More importantly, there is a huge difference between the white and green fields of these flags, and therefore these two flags are easy to tell apart. Palau also uses a similar design. Their disc is yellow and is also off-center. Their field is blue, which is also very different from Japan's white field, and once again, these two flags are easy to tell apart. For this principle, the flag scores 10 out of 10. So now we've reviewed the flag on each of the five principles. We're going to add the scores and divide by 5 to get the average. So, for the national flag of Japan, we get a final score of 9.8 out of 10.